Hi, Bride, Philadelphia Church family. Welcome back. I have a word for you this morning. The date on this is 7-9-2023. The word is called Bless. This is page one through Sister Casey. Your words are written, Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My bride, I seek that we read Acts 3 together. And as the lame man, which was healed, held Peter and John, all the people ran together unto them in the porch that is called Solomon's, greatly wondering. And when Peter saw it, he answered unto the people, Ye men of Israel, why marvel ye at this? Or why look ye so earnestly on us, as though by our own power or holiness we had made this man to walk? The God of Abraham, and of Isaac, and of Jacob, the God of our fathers, has glorified his son Jesus, whom ye delivered up and denied him in the presence of Pilate when he was determined to let him go. But ye denied the Holy One and the just and desired a murderer to be granted unto you and killed the Prince of Life whom God hath raised from the dead, whereof we are witnesses. And his name through faith and his name hath made this man strong whom ye see and know, yea, the faith which is by him has given him this perfect soundness in the presence of you all. And now, brethren, I wot that through ignorance ye did it, as did also your rulers. But those things which God before had showed by the mouth of all his prophets, that Christ should suffer, he has so fulfilled. Repent ye therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. And he shall send Jesus Christ which before was preached unto you whom the heaven must receive until the times of restitution of all things which God has spoken by the mouth of all his holy prophets since the world began. For Moses truly said unto the fathers, A prophet shall the Lord your God raise up unto you of your brethren, like unto me. Him shall ye hear in all things, whatsoever he shall say unto you. And it shall come to pass, that every soul which will not hear that prophet shall be destroyed from among the people. Yea, and all the prophets from Samuel and those that follow after, as many as have spoken, have likewise foretold of these days. Ye are the children of the prophets and of the covenant which God made with our fathers, saying unto Abraham, And in thy seed shall all the kindreds of the earth be blessed. Unto you, First God, having raised up his son Jesus, sent him to bless you in turning away every one of you from his iniquities. And I put double emphasis upon verse 26. Unto you, first God, having raised up his son Jesus, sent him to bless you, and turning away every one of you from his iniquities. I also seek to remind each of you that when I commune with my servant Casey, oops, that read unconditional love family. I commune with my servant Casey. She spends many hours in prayer and has the uttermost discipline to establish that it is I she hears. Many years, Casey practices the testing of spirits and the order of things taught to her by Father. 
I repeat this witness testimony again for anyone new who understands not how Father anoints my scribe and servant. Now I deliver a video of my son named Andrew Yelchuri. This lesson delivered by Andrew is very specific concerning honoring the ways of Father. Pay attention. As a side note, Casey looks at the hand sign of the shin, the W, and I hear her repeat the phrase, of Dr. Spock, live long and prosper. The Lord is laughing hard. I admonish Casey for her wondering mine often. Lord laughing again. As you watch this short video, reflect upon what I have laid out over several months. Understand that as bride you are priestly as I am. How my bride prays and blesses is very important. Learn the details so that as bride you are continually in alignment with the will of Father. Now I deliver three music links for my bride. We continue to dance and sing and praise Father. And yes, Shelly, we continue our prayer of Ezra 8 to seek escort. I see all, I hear all, I am. <laughs> Some in my flock allow worldly concepts to creep in and distract. Stop. Come to me when such distractions arise. I have all power to vanquish the workers of your adversary. I also deliver a wild flower for my bride. I commend you for edifying one another continually. It has beneficial impact in the spiritual realm. Stay with your hearts focused on me as we await Father's command. I cannot measure the love I have for my flock. Keep Father's blessings in the front of your minds now. Your bridegroom Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Stop time 8 for 8, I think, a.m. Might be 8 for 1. Andrew Yalchuri video, The Ironic Blessing, will be in comments and the three links for the music. This is your Wildflower Bride. So I'm just going to show you some confirmations. Okay, after like I was in this Bible app, I've got two, an e-sword in this one. Okay, so I was praying Psalms and there was one I hadn't clicked red on. So I clicked red on it and when you do that, it kicks you to an ad. Okay, and um, then when it kicks when it kicked back off of the ad it had this phrase Jesus is my rock okay and the particular ad that it kicked me to had teeth on it okay and razors and uh, what looks like claws that could be a razor I'm not sure what that is Okay, it also had a serpent on it, and uh, a guy with something, some kind of ear device pointing at it, and it says, listen, okay, so that's really interesting, Casey's a hearer, right, I'm going somewhere with this, the Lord added the shin when Casey said live long and prosper as a confirmation for me to see it because the teeth are the shin the teeth so he was showing me the teeth last night and he connected it to the word today but that's not all 
So as I was going to click on the links so I could get them in order so I can put them in comments, he shows me an ad. Now, I'm discerning what he's saying. Help by answering one question. And in the word, the Lord answered the question about continuing to pray Ezra 8. Get it? All right? And when I was retrieving this link, right underneath it, there's a telephone with a card on top of it with the number 4321 family. <laughs> there's some other numbers here, and I will go and look those up. Cause I, and I've got a cat sneezing behind me. He's pointing out a number now, I think. And a bird. He's so funny. Okay, 4321. All right, yeah, I'll look the rest of those numbers up. I'm sure there's something he's trying to show me besides just the 4321. An added note, Casey wrote, Be in alignment with the will of the Father, our words matter. Okay, as a reminder, our prayers. So pay real close attention to the video the Lord wants us to see. The Lord's been showing me Joshua the last couple of days, family. Uh, and today is Joshua 424. You can see the date on it, the 9th. That all my people of the earth might know the hand of the Lord, that it is mighty, that ye might fear the Lord your God forever. And two days in a row, I got Joshua 4, 23 and 24. For the Lord your God dried up the waters of Jordan from before you until ye were passed over, as the Lord your God did to the Red Sea, which he dried up from before us until we were gone over. That all the people of the earth might know the hand of the Lord, that it is mighty, that you might fear the Lord your God forever. Now, family, I think there's a connection here for the two different escapes. The first quiet escape of the bride is like passing over the Jordan. And then the escape of the great multitude halfway through the judgments will be like coming through the Red Sea. Let me know what your thoughts are on that. This is a little bit off subject, but I just want to highlight, you know, how the Lord confirms our brethren to me so that you can have your eyes open for the same kind of confirmations. You all know I'm a seer, but the Lord uses our eyes as our ears. Our eyes are our ears, okay? So... I was watching Jonathan, and I always do this because I know the Lord organizes every detail of my life. Everything on YouTube, every video from one to the next to the next, in my feed or underneath someone else's video, and all those numbers are all Him. He does it all. He even moves the thing up, up uh, like scrolls it for me sometimes. When he wants me to particularly look at something. And he stops and buffers it all the time to show me numbers. Or if he's wanting me to pay extra close attention, he'll jump the page. He does all kinds of stuff, okay? So here, right under Jonathan's video, is this random, you know, channel. I have no idea what it is. The number five for grace is on it. But this bear... That's a twin of good and evil. Okay, and his red eye for the connection to the pit. Right? Black and white. The twin. I mean, just right there. That's not all. Under that was, it's the same video, Jonathan, was a guy holding a girl upside down. So you got one up and one upside down. And the way her legs kind of are is like making an X. And he's holding a fish for the 153 fish for the DNA that we learned from Richard. Okay? I mean, come on, guys. <laughs> Storytelling Reddit. Never seen these things in my life. And here they're all put right under Jonathan's video. And then this too. Okay? 
What about angels? <laughs> and we're all angels in host bodies. And y'all already know the story now. We're walking in the whole truth now. So many are not, family. They're walking in half truth or completely in darkness. So we got three videos so far. Connecting dots and confirmations for Jonathan and the truth. Okay. And here's number four. This is the reality. <laughs> it's the reality of it. So four organized videos confirming all that the Lord has taught Jonathan and Richard and here on this channel. Um, so I just thought it was important to share so you guys can be on the lookout. And another thing, if the Lord doesn't want you watching somebody, he does the same thing. He'll put something there that's got something that looks like a, got the word demons on it or got the word prohibited, prohibited on it or um, witchcraft. Something will be there that's out of place that gives you a clue that you shouldn't be there if that helps you family. All right. Well, that's all I have for you. Uh, I love you all. God bless you. Talk soon. Don't forget the links and comments.